supporting you because you're vibrating in the zodiac energy of um, the um, um, your sister sign, the Taurus. Is. So this is going to be a wonderful week for you guys. It's the end, the week of the world, and the world comes back also in your reading on Friday. So this is wonderful. The energy of this week is vibrating also in your reading which is wonderful so a lot of luck and success is coming endings are coming this week is a week of trans transition in a lot of ways and I did the Sun that this is wonderful the wheel of fortune is here the Sun is here and the world is here isn't this beautiful so we have the wheel of fortune the sun and the world these are the three best 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 cards you can have these are extremely positive cards the world with the wheel of fortune because the world um, the world with the wheel of fortune and the Sun coming out these three beautiful cards congratulations I have never seen someone readings nobody else have these and this is coming on to the end of the week this is wonderful beginning of the week is a little bit out of balance I should say um, because um, it's how to balance in the sense that um, there's certain aspect if I look and this is what I'm seeing for most of the signs that there's not really because um, there's, uh, there's not really one number the energy of this week is you know it is more the the arcanas are coming in and with the arcanas coming in these are wonderful wonderful energies the first Monday of the week you're having the seven of uh, of the seven of ones the seven of one energy is the energy vibration where all of these things are happening and you're trying to protect yourself from all of the negative influence and negative aspect around you so um, this is extremely good because what is happening to you is that uh, um, you are having and uh, protect yourself from this king of swords this king of swords could be someone who you work with someone who you are partnership up in whether in business or in uh, your personal life but this king of sword person is you know he's really not balanced so you are protecting yourself from him because this man is really not balanced and he is uh, um, you have to be careful is someone who flips in and it in a minute and and this is not good as we look we have the princess the princess of um, ones and she's looking out a princess of one the energy it could be a connected for a family member or something like that that you're connected with this person some people might be having a relationship with this um, princess of ones but this princess of ones is between the ages of 21 and 35 and it can be someone who's younger and she is looking out she is looking out at this man this king of swords whatever is going on she is looking at him so it could be that uh, your husband and this is your child and looking towards him for help this is a situation that is a cosmic situation which is the energy of the wheel of fortune coming out on Thursday Thursday is a wonderful day for you Sunday is a wonderful day for you and, and, and Friday so on Thursday you have the wheel of fortune we all know that whatever situation that we're in it's going to go the, uh, the reverse side or it's going to change so if you were in a good situation all the time that changed the bad but if you are in a bad situation it's going to change to good when the wheel of fortune is coming on Friday you have the energy of the world which is extremely extremely fantastic
I am loving the wheel of fortune and the world coming right behind each other it's just so wonderful it's just so grand the universe is saying to you I am sending you new gifts if some doesn't get it with the wheel of fortune some is going to get it with the world so I'm loving this because the major oracon is are so strong in your reading which is extremely good coming out for earth sign persons and this is how the universe let these earth sign you know that they're watching over you acts this is a week for manifesting things it's a week of acting on Saturday you have the energy vibration of the seven of cups and the seven of cups energy is always that you're looking back on something you're looking um, but it's something which is good good things are about to happen to you because the seven of cups is always that there is so many other opportunities out there there are lots of opportunities so if you um, have to, your relationship is no more um, uh, of a good um, energy and that sort of a thing then you're going to realize how best you can just pick up things and move along because new things are going to come in your life as we look forward we have the energy vibration of the Sun on Sunday which is wonderful the energy vibration of the Sun is a powerful energy that is going to bring wonderful new experiences in your lives but yet still bring success riches and abundance because if you notice the form of the reading with uh, the world and the wheel of fortune these are just three of the most powerful cards that you could ever have and I am so um, aware of uh, when I'm given a reading when these cards come out and you look at the situation in certain aspect and certain situation you realize how powerful and how good this these things are because you realize that no matter what is going on around you the universe the spirit guides are always watching over you and always bringing wonderful new aspect into your life and I personally love the wheel of fortune because trust me when the wheel of fortune come in someone readings whatever situation whatever they are going through in the time at that moment you are going to see a difference come in and it has to do with how you look at certain aspects as if with the Sun the Sun brings also success but it brings also new energy vibration new life to something that has been worn out if you were tired and beat out it brings you new vitalized energy and this is good for you earth sign people to learn to work with the energy vibration of the Sun the world and the wheel of fortune because whenever you work with the energy of the Sun and you call upon say I now call upon the source of all things and the sun to flow through me and surround me you will feel so different and have such a, a, a good sort of an aspect a good sort of an energy vibration and a good sort of a aspect that is coming into your life which is just extremely wonderful you will feel yourself being changed and change and and moving forward to something which is just so extremely good so you know realize that in this week this week is going to bring a lot of success a lot of success a lot of um, money a lot of joy happiness um, but whoever this king of sword is that you're protecting yourself from constantly protect yourself from this person because this person can come at you this person is uh, um, just case uh, like from the case the case he, he, he is not um, hundred percent it's as if he flips and he go to and he flips so so sorry be aware of what is going on because uh, you need to understand how you can do certain things and how you are um, uh, you know coming out and how it looks in a certain form in a certain situation Oh, I love this. This is one of the most beautiful energy. 
um, the energy that I have here for you it's the third eye chakra so work with your third eye chakra in this week as you work with the third eye chakra I see the you the wisdom of my eye self uh, and apply this wisdom in my life so I see the wisdom of my eye self and apply this wisdom in my life again always three time I see the wisdom of my eye self and I apply this wisdom in my life and I want to say to each and every person out there enjoy your week and namaste until next week